My son was a sophomore in college and the doctor prescribed him painkillers. I wasn't aware of it because he wasn't living at home and he got addicted. He has never recovered from it yet. I knew nothing, I knew nothing at all about drugs and it was, you know, somebody, some, it wasn't my son, it wasn't my neighborhood, it wasn't, I needed to be educated, I needed to find out what I could do, how I could help my son, you know, I, I needed support, so getting educated gave me support. Uh, I'm involved in a couple organizations, I'm involved with, um, it's called Be Cares, and I also belong to another group called the Mom Squad, which is a group of moms that have kids in addiction. And it started out with five moms, now it's about 125 moms. I think there's such a negative stigma around people that use opioids is because we're afraid. A lot of people treat them less than human, and it's it's it could be anybody's kid, anybody's husband, anybody's neighbor. We have to stop the stigma so they'll reach out so we can help them so we can get this this disease you know eradicated it's it just tears up every you know families and there's so many kids out there now that don't have parents because they overdosed and you know we really have to help them we have to if you're trying to overcome your addiction reach out don't be ashamed we are our arms are open to help you we would love to, to get you through the struggle. We, we all have struggles in life. Some of it is addiction, some of it's you know money. We all have struggles. And together we can get through these struggles.